Hello Access, my name's Nathan Dytum and this is a quick look at the PlayStation app you can use with your PS4 on your iOS or Android device. After you've installed the app on your device, you can sign into your PSN account here, which will give you access to a profile page with your picture, trophies and recent activities. Across the top of the app's main page are easy to see alerts for your notifications, game invites, game alerts and messages. There's a link to the PlayStation Store so you can purchase games and add-ons remotely and, if your PlayStation is on standby, have them downloaded to your machine automatically. You can browse your trophies and compare them with your friends. You can browse your friends and send new requests. And you can keep up to date with everything using the What's New activity feed, which shows what games your friends are playing, what trophies they're earning, and even gives you access to their gameplay live streams. Aside from all the PSN functionality, you can also connect the app directly to your PS4 as long as they're connected to the same Wi-Fi network by selecting the option at the bottom left of the screen. The first time you do this, you'll need to head to the PlayStation App Connection Settings option in the PS4 Settings menu and add a device. This will generate a number to input into the PlayStation app to pair the two together. After this first time, you'll be able to just press connect to PS4 and select the machine in the menu. The app and PlayStation 4 will stay connected until one of them goes into standby. Once connected, the app can be used as a second screen, as a remote control for navigating PS4's menus, or, our favourite, as a keyboard to make typing messages to friends super easy. And that's a quick overview of the PlayStation app. Thanks for watching, if you have any questions or suggestions for other how-to videos let us know in the comments and subscribe to Access for more of our quick guides.